So I'll be showing you how to use your Samsung Smart TV without a remote. Now it could be that you've misplaced your remote or you don't feel like using your remote, maybe it's too far away. You can actually perform some basic functions on your TV without your remote. So this could be things like uh, volume control, switching the input source, uh, changing channels and stuff like that. So to do that, you do have a physical button on the TV. So right around next to the Samsung logo, there should be a button. And you use that button, pressing once will just move to the next item. And to select a specific item, you just have to long press on that button. So I'll just walk right up to the TV and show you how to do this. So on this particular Samsung TV, the Samsung logo is here. And so that means the button should be somewhere below here. And that button, when I press it once, you can see that menu appears. And on that menu, I have the power off option. I have channel up, channel down, volume up, volume down, and source. So let's say I want to power off the TV. Just make sure power off is highlighted. And then I long press on the button. And that's going to turn off my TV. Basically, just putting the TV in standby mode. To switch it back on, I just need to press that button again. So a long press on that button should turn on the TV. So it's actually a single press on that button. So pressing it once, We'll switch on the TV and pressing it again will bring up the menu and I can use now this to change channels. If I want to increase volume, I just make sure volume up is highlighted and then long press and that should increase the volume of my TV as you can see. Pressing again will go to volume down and I can use that to reduce the volume. And then of course I have the uh, source which cycles through the input sources. So if I long press on it, it's going to switch to the next input source, which is my Google TV. I long press on it again, switches to my other input device, which is my Roku. Again, takes me to TV, back to my other device. And that is basically how you can use your Samsung Smart TV without a remote. Now, alternatively, if you had already set up the uh, Samsung Smart Things app on your phone, then you can use that as your remote. So basically just using your Android phone or your Samsung phone, I mean your iPhone or your Android phone as your TV's remote. So for instance, here's my iPhone here and I have the Smart Things app already set up. All I have to do is launch the app find your TV, just select it. And then now you'll always have a remote. Now this is a full blown remote with all the functions. You can tap on that to go home. You can switch channels. You have all the buttons you need for this remote. So you have the volume controls there, as you can see, channel controls, mute and unmute button, all that stuff, all right? So those are the two ways you can use your Samsung Smart TV without the remote. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below. And I also have detailed videos on how to set up the SmartThings app on your phone to link it to the TV. And you can go ahead and watch that. Thanks for watching and good luck.